And a warm welcome from North London. We're at the Emirates Stadium. My name is Derek Ray. Excited to be bringing you match commentary. And alongside me, my broadcasting partner, Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It's Arsenal versus Everton. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. Here are the starters for Arsenal. Aaron Ramsdale is the goalkeeper. Martin Odegaard plays with Thomas Partey in central midfield. And the main forward is Gabriel Jesus. And here's the team for Everton. Jordan Pickford stands between the posts. Connor Cody plays alongside James Tarkovsky in central defence. Abdoulaye Ducouré plays alongside Idrissa Gay in central midfield. And leading the attack today is Dominic Calvert-Lewin. Potentially one to savour. Arsenal get this game underway. Martin Odegaard. Crossing possibilities. Oh, big opportunity. And thumped away. High quality defending. Jorginho and a chance Odegaard superb save well he should score of course but that's a brilliant save Can someone get on the end of this? And a bit short with the clearance. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Marcinelli. Oh, great attacking play. And the keeper there to catch it under no real pressure. He has been one of the leading lights in the competition so far, Gabriel Jesus. Well, Derek, he's the perfect finisher. He's got a great shot on him. His movement is excellent. And in 1v1 situations, you always expect him to score. To jump in front. Well, sadly for him, chipping it over the top. Well, that's a waste of a good opening. That's a really poor attempt. Jorginho really good interception Onana McNeil and behind it's gone for a corner And there's the delivery. Danger averted for now. Calvert Lewin. An alert piece of defending.
Gabriel. And the cross comes to nothing. Alexander Zinchenko. And that's an important intervention. Calvert Lewin. It's with Erdogan. And winning it back. And can they exploit the space out wide? Opportunity to deliver the cross. Can they forge ahead? And fired against the crossbar. And a goal! That will do it. They've been pushing for it. And now they've been rewarded. Well, as the replay shows us, it's a decent first effort, but he's so quick to get onto the rebound. That's a good finish. Everton goal. One nil then. Number 16, Abdelay Dukore. Gabriel and a poor ball Bukayo Saka chance to cross this could square the game shot blocked but still alive and a goal, it was served up on a silver platter for him. Well, just look at the defending here. They've made it so easy for him in the end. That's just not good enough. underway following the equaliser over the touchline for what will be an Everton throw Cody and now Gay McNeil well, the crossing needs to be a bit better than that. Well, the stats don't lie. Arsenal had most of the possession, but without really creating too many chances. Which, when you look at the players out on the pitch, it's really disappointing. They need to play with far more urgency to win this game. Martin Odegaard. Well read to ease the pressure. Really sitting deep now. That could be problematic. And promising stuff from Arsenal. To take the lead. There is the goal. And you could almost see that coming. They were sitting ever deeper. And now they've really paid the price. Well, here's the replay. He does well to find that bit of space in the box, and then he shows a lot of composure to finish it off. That's a good goal. Everton having shipped a goal, now have work to do going forward.
Well, the half-time whistle fast approaching. It's Arsenal with the lead. Stuart, interested to get your thoughts on their performance so far. Well, it's been a good watch so far. Both sides have tried to play on the front foot. Oh, Stuart, they must score! Penalty in the opinion of the referee. And this is seriously getting away from them. Well, some might say he's been fortunate to avoid being shown the card. Well, I like that from the referee. Just because it's a penalty doesn't mean it's a yellow card. I think he's got it right. Is it going to be 3-1? And he slots it home with confidence. Well, here it is again. And how many times have you seen players get this wrong? But not on this occasion. Gets his foot underneath it, slows it all down, dinks it down the middle. A great penalty. So on with the action. And 3-1 the scoreline at the moment. We will have three minutes of additional time at the end here. And space to attack. It might end up being a genuine chance. And he read it well, intercepting it. Calvert Lewin. And there it is, the referee's whistle. The first half has come to an end here in North London. Well, such is the lot of an attacking player. Some days it works for you, on other days, not at all, Stuart. Yeah, I've been really disappointed with him today, Derek. He just hasn't looked himself, but I think it's fair to say he hasn't had great service, has he? And the game begins. So, back in business, Everton's difficulties there for all to see in the first half. How do they respond now? Let's find out. Arsenal pushing forward with options available. But quick thinking defensively. Just failing to hit the target with his pass. And it'll be a throw-in. Calvert-Lewin. He will be. Oh, he's given the ball away. Calvert-Lewin. He will be. Can he take the chance? What a save. And a poor ball. And a good-looking pass. And options in the centre. And after the cross, a tremendous block. Corner kick played in. Relatively straightforward to mop up defensively. Bukayo Saka. Ben White. And Arsenal now find themselves in potentially a dangerous position. Well, as you can see, Arsenal have had most of the ball and have used it really well today, particularly in the midfield areas. And I expect more of the same as the game goes on. Yes, it's going to plan, and they might be able to carve out another chance. And it's Gabriel Jesus. Well, possibilities in the centre. Struggling to get it away.
That's great goalkeeping. Well, what a save that is. He was so alert there. Delivering it. Well, a bit short with the clearance. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Corner awarded to Arsenal. And there's the delivery. Well, still an issue here. Martinelli. Well, behind for another corner. Go, go. <laughs> Over it comes. Well, not the best clearance. A really top-notch piece of defending. Well, that's really strong play to keep hold of the ball. Opportunity it is. The ball is loose. Well, nothing comes of it. Jesus. Covert Lewin. And a good looking ball. Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. Into the final 20 minutes. Perfect tackle. Calvert Lewin. And he read it really well. Fine save. And time for the change now. And over comes the corner. He will be. The defender doing his job. Out of play and an Everton throw in forthcoming. He will be. And now to Kure. He will be. And a decent delivery. Just unable to take advantage of that developing situation. Just 15 minutes remaining. Tierney. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. It will be. Can they hit on the break? They need to get bodies back. Can he get one back? Oh, incredible save. And he snuffed out the danger. Well, he's lost it. Ducouré. Great reflex action. Well, that should have been a goal. Mind you, it's a brilliant save. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. Substitution for Arsenal. Coming off the pitch, number eight, Martin Ogre. Coming onto the pitch, number 34, Granit Xhaka. Corner kick played in. Relatively straightforward to mop up defensively. Coleman. Cody. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. Well, in the dying embers of the game, but Arsenal still full of life. A most enjoyable performance.
Well, I think the scoreline reflects the difference between the two teams. For most of the game, they've dictated the play and they've created some really good chances. I think it's been an excellent performance. Trying to deliver it accurately. Not the best clearance. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Tom Davis. And that'll be an Everton throw in. Mikolenko. McNeil, now Gay, can he finish, oh a goal to reduce the deficit, my goodness that gets the pot boiling, it's not over yet. Well let's take another look and it's not good enough defensively, they're slow to react, don't get tight enough and don't deal with the situation and there's the outcome. It is. Who would have predicted that before a ball was kicked? Trossard. And offside it is. They're making high pressing work for them here. Well, this might be their final opportunity to draw level. So Everton trailing and looking for inspiration from this corner. And they deal with the threat this time. And now it is official. The referee brings this match to an end. And it's a victory for the Gunners. Well, Derek, it was very competitive. Chances at both ends. But I feel they were the better team. And they deserve their victory. Well, we're highlighting him for a reason, Stuart. He's put in a really authoritative performance here. Well, he was a major reason why they won today. He was so reliable and he inspires those around him. Chance to create.